that was lost restore everything that was stolen restore everything that was lost restore you will restore restore everything that was lost restore everything that was stolen restore everything that was lost restore you will restore one more time restore everything that was lost Hallelujah. I want you to receive the prophetic word now. When God sends us, we come in the name of the Lord. Restore everything that was lost. Restore everything that was stolen. Restore the honor that was lost. Restore, you will restore. Restore everything that was lost. Restore, my God. Everything that was stolen, restore. Everything that was lost, restore. You will restore. Come, play the saxophone for me. Go ahead. I want to prophesy. I'm just walking by the Spirit. And when that happens, I'm going to begin to speak. Go ahead. in the name of Jesus Christ let me start with those who have lost things 
you have lost things in the name that is above all names I'm praying now here at Koinonia by the power that raised Christ from the dead from Abuja to Zaria to UK to US to Canada across Africa Koinonia global and indeed the body of Christ I stand by the privilege of the election of grace and I decree and declare let there be a restoration now 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 tragic events that don't have an explanation from losses financial depletions the death of loved ones the loss of relationships close doors in the name of Jesus the spirit that is behind it I come by the rod of the apostolic and the prophetic I decree and declare that spirit gives way now that spirit gives way now that spirit gives way now every mark upon your head you may not see it but it keeps calling tragedies to your life in the name of Jesus Christ by the blood of the eternal covenant I wipe that mark from your face now I wipe that mark from your destiny now Hear me. Everyone you have lost favor with, lost touch with, in this place tonight, by the mercy of God, I command restoration. I command reconnection. I command restoration. I command reconnection in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Now I want to pray specifically for those who are in any kind of financial trouble. I've owed people before. I know what it means. The, 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 the pain only God can explain what it takes to not be able to have a sound sleep because there are bills you are owing, whether institutionally, whether corporately, whether personally. None of them is profitable. I pray for you. The same grace that brought the axe head from the waters in the name of Jesus. Every financial situation you have gotten into that is leaving you now with shame and embarrassment by the power that raised Christ from the dead before the end of 2023, come out of that situation. Come out of that situation. By the ministry of men, come out of that situation. By the ministry of favor, come out of that situation. By the ministry of wisdom, come out of that situation. By the ministry of mercy, come out of that situation. In the name of Jesus Christ. For those who have lost time, delay has happened in your life. And the truth is that time has gone. Even if the constraints were taken away from your life, it will take grace for you to catch up. I pray for you. There is speed and there is restoration. These are the two mysteries that help men to redeem time. The Bible says redeeming the time because the days are evil. And there are two spiritual forces allocated for time redemption. One is called speed. Another is called restoration. When God wants to help you, you will experience both. Restoration brings yesterday into tomorrow. Speed moves you further into your tomorrow. I pray for you by the force of speed and the force of restoration. May time be redeemed now. May time be recovered now by the forces of speed and the forces of restoration. May time be redeemed now.